Fight on! Yo everyone, what up? Welcome back to Top Tier Arcade, my name is Steve, and we're back in my parents' garage, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at the Neo Geo 6 lot, this is going to be part 3, the game review of Art of Fighting. So a little um, about the Art of Fighting itself, now when I picked up the game, um, I got it from eBay, I made it easy, I didn't want to look around because it would take too long. To be honest, I found it for 40 it was 15 American with 15 shipping, blah blah blah, $40 Canadian. So a pretty good deal. Um, got it for f uh, forty bucks. You know, works straight out the uh, straight out the gate, which is great. So that was the pickup of it. The um, you know the the interesting part about Art of Fighting when it first came out, it came out in ninety two September, and it was well received. You know, it was again the Street Fighter killer, and a lot of people were checking it out. It was unique because the actual game itself. The sprites were big, like it actually had scaling, like when you came close, and we'll play it momentarily, when you scale the characters close, they're bigger, and then when you're spread apart, you know, they're smaller. So it's almost like zooms in, which is awesome. I love the big sprites, great colors, you know, great sound too. Very great sound, again, with the stereo that Street Fighter 2 didn't have. Um, that was a great improvement. And the actual, this was the first game to actually have super moves. And with it, because they had three bonus stages, and during the story mode, you actually learn the more moves. There's desperation moves at the end where you can pull off. Um, you actually uh, can do, again, big super moves with your power. Um, it even has battle damage, so you'll see people getting beat up. Um, you'll see people getting scratched, and you'll see physically their face, which is neat. Never seen that before. I remember. You know, seeing that and being freaked out, like, wow, look at that, look, at, you're, you're actually beating the crap out of him, and you can see it. Very neat. And it was interesting, because I guess a lot of people were playing it, and it was popular, and Neo G was really getting its footing, because this was one of the first fighting games for it, and games, and this was their, I guess Capcom either was afraid, or maybe insulted, because Art of Fighting, uh, the main character is Ryo, R-Y-O. Well, Street Fighter has Ryu, R-Y-U, or Ru, you know, Ryu. So I guess, you know, they you know, kind of took a stab at that. Um, and they created Dan out of that. Believe it or not, Ryo and Robert, which is the two main uh, protagonists in it, they, like, the, the story is they go to find their kidnapped sister. And, you know, if you want to play it, I won't ruin the ending, but, you know, you have to fight through... Um, you have to kind of get clues, like one person's like, I think it's, they're on the harbor, then you have to fight this person, then no, they're at the bar, and you have to fight that. So, that was very interesting, and I guess Capcom made Ryo and Robert one character in uh, Street Fighter named Dan. Now, if you're a big Street Fighter heads, you would know this, in Street Fighter Alpha, Dan was a hidden character, and he has a pink gi and a green gi. And ideally, they combined a lot of the, the look and quotes from Ryo and Robert um, to make Dan, so it was an actual stab at SNK, and you can ever, you know, you can see that if you ever want to check out, you know, Dan the character and where he came from. So uh, my memories about this game was again, I remember when my uh, when my brother, I guess, would take me around the arcades, like I've said in my other videos. There was a computer place near where we used to live, and we used to go to school. And he would rent, he would rent video games and rent computer games and fix. He was a computer store, and he would have three or four arcade machines. He had hard driving. I still remember that the game that you know you have to actually turn a key and it's like three D. Um, they had Art of Fighting, and I can't remember. Oh, sorry, excuse me, Neo Geo Four Slot, and they had uh, another game. I can't. Remember. I think they had Street Fighter as well. Um, but Art of Fighting took a lot of heat from Street Fighter because it was kind of like it's different and look at the characters and whatnot. And I remember sitting there and it was like, yo, this is going to be Street Fighter, this is going to be Street Fighter. Now, a lot of people claimed that, but, you know, they, they didn't because Street Fighter is still up and alive today and, you know, killing it. But, um, you know, this was something that I used to, like, everyone used to play, you know, try to find out the special moves because everybody's like, wow, they have super moves that you had to do, they have three bonus stages, one you have to break the bottles, like cut the top off like Miyagi did in Karate Kid 1, uh, the second one was um, you have to do three of the big super moves, which one else is I missing? Uh, 
I can't remember the other one. Is it an arm wrestling? I can't remember. There's a, there's there's three um, there's three um, no arm wrestling fatal fury. Anyways, there's there's three um, bonus stages that you have to go through and then you build up. So with that, it was it was great. I remember when we rented from that same computer place the Neo Geo AES, which is the home console version. And we used to play that as well. And I used to, you know, play with my brother. And this, you know, this it was harder to pull off moves than Street Fighter. It's a little more difficult with this one. And again, you know, your power goes down. You can taunt the person. Like you have, uh, you have like your key or chi meter, and you can taunt them, and it lowers your, um, you know, lowers their ability to your ability to do super moves. Because if you don't have your key meter, you can't do super moves. So that's another element, that, you know, that was very new. So. Very, very cool game, brought a lot of neat elements, uh, great graphics, you know, great sound, and a pretty cool story, and, you know, it went from, you know, Art of Fighting, uh, you know, 1, 2, and 3, and you would see the characters in, you know, King of the Fighter games, you'd see them in mix-up, you know, the Capcom versus SNK and whatnot. So without further ado, that's a little bit of the history, a little bit of everything in one. Let me set you up, we'll do some gameplay, you know, just show you what I've been speaking about, we'll take it from there. Alright guys, let's do this. So this is Art of Fighting. I'm going to show you guys some gameplay. Nothing too crazy, just to give you some dynamics and some um, variations of fighters and whatnot. So let's go ahead. We've coined up. Let's do this. The cool thing about Neo Geo games, they always show you how to play. Which I think is very fair. So they show you how to play. Um, I won't go through the whole thing, but they're very straightforward. But again, uh, we're going to pick Ryo. Let's do this. So look at the big sprite. Now this is just the actual story. Look at see how the sprites are small and then they get bigger when you get in? Very different. So let's get to it. And this is not that it's this game. Oh my god, very difficult. You see my See how it was a lot weaker? Because I don't have that much key. Now you can build your key by hold, pressing hold again A and B together. You see the battle damage? I've been getting beat up. That's awesome. Big sprites compared to Street Fighter. So then the Neo Zoom. Very cool. One of my favorite moves. Cool, great sound effect. You can jump off walls, which is neat. And I die. Oh no, not yet. Ah. This game is tough. I'm not. I'm not good. I'm not that good. I didn't have a lot of time to practice. No excuse. But uh, yeah, a lot of the mechanics I've forgotten. So let's try to get. Let's try to get this guy down there. Pretty cool story mode. So then, you know, obviously, you're like, where's my sister? Look, I don't know where he is, but this guy named Mac, and obviously, you just keep going. Yuri. Yuri's his sister, which you'll see her in uh, Art of Fighting 2, 3, I think, and all the other games. And uh, King of Fighters and whatnot. Oh, 
gameplay whatsoever, but very cool. Try again in the big moves, really. Uh, damn it! Oh, I got him. Suck it. Again, he can steal my, uh... Shit. Ah, I was weak. See, if I had more power, I would've got to him. Game's tough, man. Hehe. <laughs> So far, so good. I do want to get the king. Oh, I'm gonna show you guys something. Anyways, let's get to it. Oh, cool, a bonus game. Oh, the other one was ice breaking. Remember, I was saying it, the ice breaking. This one's been my. F this one's cool because you have to do this. This super. This again. Very cool. So you have to do. Uh, you know, a super super. Forest or whatever, it's, it's kind of neat. Well, I already knew how to do that. Uh, I don't think we're gonna get. I want to get to. Uh, this guy's tough. See a little, you know, introduction cinematic. Very cool. This guy's tough. This guy's really tough. Let's try to use that new move. <laughs> I didn't see my uh, meter was low. So you can't spam fireballs in this. Very difficult to spam fireballs. So if you press D, I'll be like, come on, come on, and then it lowers again his key, which is neat. So you can't spam, that's why it's kind of very different from Street Fighter. Good change. Damn it. 
So this one says press A continuously to recover. Let me just try that. I'm curious. I never. I thought you just have to hold it. One second. <laughs> Gameplay, just want to show you some dynamics what we spoke about in the intro. This game's super loud, man. So that's pretty much, uh, that pretty much does it. So guys, if you guys haven't had time to uh, subscribe, please go ahead and subscribe. There's more to come. Next is going to be Samurai Showdown. Show you guys some gameplay of that. Alright, thanks for checking out Top Tier. Peace. Get hit!